Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nana and in today's video we are going to do a red lip try on. Well, the fall is here and it's one of my favorite seasons to wear a red lip. Something about just the winter, the cold, uh, red lip just really looks great on uh, most of the makeup looks I do during this season and I kind of leave the nude pinky lips for the summertime. I've got a few that I really enjoy that I want to bring to you guys. So if you're interested, keep watching. So in today's video, I'm going to be using one lip liner throughout this video. It is from Fiona Styles in the color Traction. This is a really beautiful red. It's uh, just deep enough to create a really beautiful line. So I think you guys will really like it. So let's get in. All right. So this is the compact that I have here. It's really beautiful as you can see. It's got like these black um, rock studs all over it. Um, kind of stones with this like uh, holographic look on it. I really, really like it. Uh, almost like an oil slick. I bought it from Sephora during their last year, their like 2018 holiday season. But yep, just gonna go in with this to line my lips. So the lips are lined, so let's get into the lip try on. I am going to start with bullet lipsticks and then move into the liquid lipsticks. So the first one I have here is one of my favorite red lips, it is from Urban Decay. It is from Urban Decay, and it is in the shade Love Drunk. It's from their Comfort Matte line, or formula. And what I really like about this is that it's a deeper red, but still with that blue undertone, so it's really, really wearable. That is so pretty. I love the look of that. It just makes my teeth look really white, which is one thing I really love about reds, is they just really brighten up my uh, teeth. And on top of that, it's just really just flattering. So, love this color. Looks so good. Okay, so we have that removed and the lip line, the lip liner reapplied. Let's go in with the next color. It is from Urban Decay again in the shade F Bomb and it's their cream formula so this is going to be a little bit more creamy a little bit more with a sheen on the lips let's go in and that is the shade f bomb applied i really really like it i think it's really beautiful like that just really pops guys so, yeah, that's F-Bomb from Urban Decay. So, in between removing the lip, just to keep my lips from getting dry, I will be applying this. It is from NYX. It is their Bear With Me Cannabis Detivia Seed Oil Lip Conditioner. Um, it applies almost like a lip gloss. But I find it to be really nourishing. So, this is uh, recently to the NYX line so definitely worth checking out because it's really good and pretty affordable okay the next color i have is from l'oreal this is like their ultra i'm not exactly sure the formulation of this um it's almost like a more full coverage lip tint situation it is in the shade 426 i am worth it and what i really like about this is that it just is so like lightweight on the lips Almost like a liquid lipstick, but without the um, dryness that most people experience. Okay, that is the shade I Am Worth It from L'Oreal. So what do you guys think? So it's got a little bit of shine on it. It will dry down so it won't be as uh, kind of a glossy, 
but I really like it. It's really lightweight on the lips, like can barely feel it. And I like the applicator, it has a fine point. It's just really comfortable. This is a really good choice. I actually have this formulation in about two or three other colors. I really like them from L'Oreal. So L'Oreal has become one of my favorite brands in the um, drugstore. Just really like their products, complexion, lips. Definitely want to get more into their mascaras because you don't always need to be spending $25 on mascara. But yeah, this is the color on me. All right, so that color does kind of stain the lips but I've taken off as much of it as I can. So let's go move forward with the next color. What I have here is from Kylie Cosmetics. This is the Velvet Liquid Lipstick in the color Red Velvet. I really like the Velvet formulations from Kylie Jenner. I have it in another color um, as well, and I really like the way that they feel on my lips. They're not too drying. I've tried the mattes. They just don't work for me. But this one is really, really pretty, and you guys are gonna see, like, on my complexion it just looks so good so I definitely recommend especially all our more of our melanated queens to try out red velvet from Kylie Jenner So that is Red Velvet from Kylie Jenner Cosmetics. Gorgeous color. It is about as bright that I will go for me. I think this is probably the, like, the brightest red that I have. Um, it's pretty close to F-Bomb, Just a, this one just a little bit more turned up. Um, but I don't find that it goes like orangey on me. I don't really reach go for orangey reds. So otherwise though, I love it. Like I just look, this just looks so like cute. It's a look. Um, for me, whenever I, just a note, whenever you, I like to do red lips, I like to keep the rest of my makeup pretty simple. And I kept my eye look very simple. Literally all that's in there is like a same skin tone matte and then something a little bit brighter up above and then a black liner. I like to really keep it simple whenever on the eyes and then kind of let the lip stand out. But yeah. Okay, into the next lip color, we are doing... Tarte's Tartiest Lip Paint in the shade Cheerleader. This is one of my favorite reds of all time. Beautiful color. The formula can just be a little bit drying, especially if you kind of have a fuller lip situation going on, but nothing that can't be fixed with some lip balm. Okay, so that is Cheerleader from Tarte. Tarte is lip paint on the lips. Love it. It's such a beautiful color. I love it on me so much. Um, again, just makes just makes me look so cute. I love it. Um, just happens to be just a little bit dry, but again, <laughs> this is just really great lip color. Like, oh my gosh. Okay, so we're gonna switch gears for just a moment and do a lip gloss. This one I have here is from Ulta. It's their High Shine Color Lip Gloss in the shade Grace. So a red lip gloss. Now, a red lip gloss, it can be kind of messy if you're not careful, but I find that it's just really pretty and gives you that, um, I don't know, it's just a really pretty, like glosses are just so beautiful on the lips, so flattering. And so I like to try to introduce a red whenever I can. Let's try this on. And that's the red lip gloss. What do we think? I don't know, I actually makes it, think it makes it look like just really like fun and not just, not so like glam and serious. So you still get like that really 
I don't know, I feel like it's kind of like the sophistication of a red lip and boldness of a red lip. But now in a gloss, it's just kind of fun. Okay, so we've dabbed that red lip gloss off and we are going to put on our final shade because, ooh, my lips are going through it. <laughs> this is from Dose of Colors and it's in their shade Extra Saucy. I picked this up during the 21 Days of uh, Beauty Ulta sale. So I think I bought this for maybe $19.50, I think sounds about right. No, not $19.50, $9.50. Woo! And what I really like about this color is it is just a little bit deeper than the other red liquid lipsticks that I've tried on, but still very just bold and very, um, just very flattering, I would say. All those things I've said about looking great on my complexion, making my teeth look white, making my lips look great, it's all in this one. So let's put it on. Yeah, it looks great. What do you guys think? It's a little bit, just a little bit deeper than the other reds that I've tried on. But this, these are the ones I find to be my true blue reds. And then I've got a little, kind of some deeper ones. So if you're interested in maybe going a little bit deeper, I definitely have some recommendations on those. I can do a video on that. But that is all of the, um, well, it's not all of them in my collection, which is why I told myself I need to stop buying, picking them up. But they really are my favorite to do. I think whenever I fell in love with makeup, I fell in love with red lipstick first. It was always so hard to find a nude, you know? Uh, very These nudes that were out on the market were very light, very pale, too pinky, and so, or you had to do like a dark brown. So for me, they had they always had like great reds and they've just always kind of been the staple ever since then and of course my mom she used to wear red lipstick so red lipstick just has a place in my heart and i just gravitate to them so strongly but those are the ones that i have tried on for you today you can check them out the like link below i'll try to remember to do that even though i like all my other videos i've yet to do it but yeah guys it's your girl Nana. Thank you so much for being here. If you like me, subscribe. If you like the video, thumbs it up. And of course, I just want you guys to have a beautiful day wherever you are. Bye, YouTube.